Hi everyone, welcome to Sean Allen Films The Educational Series. I'm Sean Allen. Today's episode is going to be a little bit different from the others. Today we're going to be looking at a brief summary of all the videos about the skeletal system. Along the way, you'll see these little tiny boxes appear here and there. Like, right here. Right here. Oh, there's one. There's another one. Oh, there's one in my face. <sighs> but what were those things anyway? Those are what are called annotations. And those annotations will contain links to videos of episodes that we'll be talking about in today's episode. So like for example, if I was talking about the skull, well guess what, there's an episode about that and this is what you would see. That's the annotation, but we're not talking about the skull just yet. So if you see one of those annotations pop up, click on it. It will take you to that episode, trust me. You won't regret it. Be aware that not many viewers will be able to see this feature. For example, if you're watching this on a cell phone, you might not be able to see the annotation. Oh, don't worry. The links to the last eight episodes will be down in the description of this video. That way, if you're on a cell phone, you can scroll down and click on the video you want to watch. So if you're ready, let's summarize the entire skeletal system. In part one, we talked about how the skeleton is divided into two sections, the axial skeleton and the appendicular skeleton. We also looked at the skull. It looks like one major bone, but it is actually composed of many bones. How many bones, you're asking? Well, click the annotation or the link in the description of this video to find out. In part two, we learned about teeth. We talked about how there are four different types of teeth, incisors, canine, premolars, and molars. Plus, we also talked about the different sections of teeth. Click the link down below or click the annotation to check out this video. Part three was my favorite. We talked about the vertebral column. It's divided into five sections and has up to 26 bones. It not only serves to help support a skeleton, but it protects a very important organ in the body. Can you guess what it is? Well, to find out, click on the annotation or the link in the description of this video to find out the answer. In part four, we talked about three different sections of the skeleton. The rib cage, the pelvic girdle, and the pectoral girdle. We learned that there are three different types of ribs and it helps protect our lungs and heart. Then we started looking at the pectoral and pelvic girdle. Want to learn more? Click the link below or the annotation above. Did I forget to mention that I wore a cool shirt for that episode? Yep, it was pretty cool. We moved on and talked about the limbs in part five. In that episode, we learned about the different bones in your arms and your legs. Oh, and one quick note, we didn't talk about the hands or the feet. Professor Val Kimmel mentioned about that in a little bit. In that episode, we learned that one of your limbs contains the longest bone in your body. Which one is it? Well, click the annotation or the link down below to find out. In part six, we looked at the bones in your hands and your feet. There was a particular name that was used twice to describe two similar but different bones in the hands and feet. What is it? Well, you know what to do. And then we come to part seven where we talked about how a bone heals. And guess what? I got to take over the episode for Sean because he broke his arm. How? Well, he fell off a ladder. <laughs> Yep, it's true. Once Sean got better, we moved on into part eight. And that was where we learned about the different movements and joints of the skeletal system. And by the way, that was actually the last episode. So if you want to see that one, click this annotation up here. It's the one that you normally see on these episodes. And last but not least, we have part nine. Hey, that's the episode you're watching right now. That's right, folks. And you know what that means. A quick review? No, a farewell to the skeletal system. 
we have spent a lot of time looking at the different bones, joints, movements, and all sorts of cool things about the skeleton. And that's not all, folks. There's a whole lot more to the skeletal system than what we refer to in these videos. So whenever you get a chance, be sure to go to your local library or browse the web to find out more information about the skeletal system. Well, everybody, I can officially announce that we have concluded looking at the skeletal system. Hey, thanks a lot, Prop, for letting us use your very special skeleton prop. Hey, my pleasure. I'm glad you could put it to good use. Well, that's all for today's episode, everybody. I hope you enjoyed it. But hey, we're not finished with the human body just yet. Next week, we're starting in on a brand new series. You can probably guess what it's about, right? Can you guess? Ugh, there's your hint. Yep, the muscular system. Before you go, be sure to like this video and leave a comment telling us what you thought about today's show. Be sure to also check out the official Sean Allen Films Educational Series Facebook page. The link is down below. Well, that's all for today. Until next time, keep on learning. <laughs> that was terrible. Okay, bye. <laughs>